next portion of the screencast is going to be pretty brief, but it's important and I want to make sure everybody knows what they're doing. Specifically, we're going to walk through how you can add events in the events calendar to your site's menu. Now everybody treats their menus a little bit differently and everybody finagles them a little bit differently, but this process is going to be consistent regardless of how you do it. Come into the dashboard of your site and come into appearance, then go into menus. And make sure that your menus are fully configured in terms of they're plugged into their proper theme locations, etc. I'm probably going to be working with this one called Main Menu. When I go back to the front end of my site and refresh, the Main Menu does include one option called Events. That's the same thing that we're seeing on the back end here, so I know that any items I want to add, I'm going to add into this Main Menu. Where can I add? Well, I have these options right down here. I have Event Categories over here, where I can check the box and add a full-on Event Category, where the link will just take me to the loop for that category. Or I can link into individual events. If I want to link to the full events calendar, which is what we see up here already, that can also be done from this events panel. Come into view all and it's going to be the first option here. You'll just check the box and hit add to menu. But since somebody else has already done that, I'm going to come in here and I'm going to wipe it and I'm going to go ahead with something else. Let's say that we want to link to a specific event, say WordCamp Victoria. I'll select it, I'll hit add to menu. I'll make sure that when it adds to the menu, both it shows as an event right here, or if it's a category, it should show as an event category, and that when I save menu, it saves upon reload. We're in good shape there, so now if I go back and refresh the front end, I should see WordCamp Victoria appearing in the menu. Indeed I do, and if I click through to it, it's going to take me to that entry. So if you know how to add events to the menu, this isn't going to be anything new or reinventing the wheel, but since a lot of people didn't, this should clear you up and should get you where you want to be. Let's get back into the rest of the functionality in our next screencast. See you there.